<clears throat> Hello friends, it's me Doom and today we are looking at how to make money as quickly as possible here on Fishing Planet and if you are just joining us late, if you're not catching this live, this is a perfect opportunity for me to basically go through what it is that you're going to be doing to go from zero to hero all the way from, uh, I don't know, broke to not broke. Uh, right now we're gonna be starting obviously at the Lone Star Lake catching the striped bass. We're not gonna be doing that Then once you can you're gonna be heading over here uh, To st. Croix. Nope. Just kidding. You're gonna be heading to Emerald Lake to catch walleye and I've got many videos on that link in the description perhaps and then uh, Yeah, finally st. Croix and then uh, one thing I do suggest that you do is start stockpiling money now for the uh, upcoming for the upcoming release of DLC. Uh, so yeah, do that. Also, since you're just joining us, and hello everybody! Let me make sure my live chat is going. <clears throat> Wrong one. It is, I think, test. That's not how you spell test. Test. There we go. Cool, it is. Alright, so, uh, some things. Right quick. Um, since I have your attention and this video is just starting. Um, Fishing Planet IRL Fishing Tournament Challenge Thing Situation is being filmed next week, guys. Hello, Peter. If it works in the UK, I'm assuming it works everywhere. I hold you guys to high standards. <laughs> um, <clears throat> but, like I was saying, Fishing Planet IRL Fishing Challenge comes out next week. The live action situation where we pit two teams against each other in the real world. One armed with knowledge of the lake, one armed with knowledge of... Of Fishing Planet only, and we see just how accurate Fishing Planet is. Alright, so I'm in. <clears throat> Excuse me. Said some, uh, some, some goat gouda. Really good. Uh, gouda. Yes. Uh, however, <clears throat> dries out the throat a bit. Now, let's see here. Let's go ahead and catch us. Well, catch us some money. First, let's see, let's make sure we got everything we're going to need to make all that money. And we're going to be heading over to Bates. We're going to go to Fresh. Fresh Bates. Shiners. We need Shiners. We need lots of Shiners. I don't have any Shiners. I'm Shinered out. Interesting. All right, let's, uh... All right. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60... 70, 80, 90, and that's good, because that's all I can afford. And how are we doing on minnows, large minnows? Large minnows, I got eight. I mean, I can get more there. Hello, Krista! And hello again, Peter. That's a good question, but the good news here is that, um, oh, I need to get that out of here. Stupid. Um, the good news here is that there is a setting that is its own bite alarm, and I'm going to show that to you right now, I believe. What the hell is that? Anyway, uh, let's see, where were we? Uh, snag warnings. Oh, I'll turn that on, see what that does. Um, somewhere around here. Mmm, where was it? Okay, well, let me apply that. There is, I swear, a thing that allows you... It's like a little ding. It dings. It dings when there's stuff. Uh, whenever there's a bite. Wrong button again, sorry. I'll move this out of the way. Uh, audio... There we are. Alright, if you go to audio, you can get float fishing bite sound. 
Um, and that's not when, you know, it's time to set the hook. It just alerts you when there's a fish that has spawned nearby and is ready to to bite your shit. So, um, so that's good. That's, I think, the closest thing to, uh, to that we're gonna get. Until the expansion, of course, because that's gonna, you're gonna, there's gonna be rod pods and all that other stuff. And yeah. Now, let's, um, see here. I've got that. Oh, good. It's really helpful, especially, uh, for float fishing. I'm not a big fan of float fishing. I'm not. Uh, in real life, yes, which uh, uh, Fishing Planet IRL is going to be going for channel catfish, and uh, yeah, there's going to be some float fishing, obviously. Oh, no, over here. <clears throat> uh, let's get together my gear here. Um, I need a... I'm going to switch back to this guy because I like it so much. It's fancy and such. Uh, number four ought... And, uh, 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 shiners. There we are. So I would expect to have some kind of bite alarm system with the update. They're introducing rod pods where you can just put your rod down and fish with another rod. So it would make sense, you know? So we're also going to be doing, <clears throat> the, excuse me, I'm sorry about this guys, I got some serious flemage or something going on here. Oh, 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 y'all didn't see that. It's not that I don't like randoms, I do like randoms because Fishing Planet is a community. And uh, it's good to, to help each other out. Well, thank you. Lace, ooh, Lace Lou? Laszlo, Laszlo, yes. Thank you, Laszlo. I really appreciate that. Now, um, <clears throat> where were we? I was going to say something interesting. See, that would be cool to have in-game. I don't have any pop-up rigs myself, but... Instant, instant set pop-up regs would be actually really cool. Especially if you're... I mean, I'm not too big on carp. When I eat fish, it's usually saltwater fish. Because I'm one of those people. Um, but... Um, if I were catching chum. Or something for cut bait. Then three or four of those would be pretty cool. Like, in one day, I could easily catch a freezer full of stuff. Alright, so I've got this going. What's the weather look like? I didn't actually look. Oh, 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 the one thing I forgot to say at the very beginning of this. Guys, join the Discord. Because you get a chance to play with me and make suggestions for the channel and all that other stuff. The Discord link for the Discord is down at the bottom in the description and all that. Um, alright, so I'm going to be going to about 7, 8. Yeah, going to 8. Also, I need help with this Fishing Planet IRL. In specific, I need to, uh, I need suggestions for the, for the losing team. Like, for instance, guys, what, uh, what should be the punishment for the losing team on Fishing Planet IRL? Uh, so far, we've got some good good uh, suggestions, including lick one entire fish. Um, I mean, that's pretty good. I think. I'd be, I'd be, I'd watch that. Yes, yes. Uh, the canoe. Uh, I don't. I don't have a canoe of my own, and I don't like spending money on renting a canoe. So what I do is, I, I do it from here. Although there is no no penalty for using a canoe, especially if you already own one. Oh god, hold on. I forgot what uh how deep do I have my hook set? Well it wasn't quite ready. Dang it. Yes, yes. Yep, 
Yeah, way, ooh, yes, way too deep. All right, we're, so we're gonna go to about 17 inches. So I have a question for y'all, and that is a, a subscriber of mine asked me earlier today on uh, via via message or uh, comment. That's what it was. Excuse me. He said uh, that there are blue catfish here, but he has no idea where, and I also have no idea where. And if you guys have an idea where, uh. Let me know, because that'd be an awesome question to answer, and I think good for another video. It looks like I've got a bite here. Three, no, wait, hold on. I've gotten pretty good at this. I didn't switch time, did I? Nope, okay. Well, this is going to be a rather small one, but that's okay. So, Mr. Law, where exactly in the UK are you from, out of curiosity? Oh, yeah, go for it, man. It's a open room for, uh, for friends. Uh, I guess you can... I guess some of your friends' requests. Let me know when you've... you have done so, and, uh... I will, uh, accept it, and you can join. Never been to rugby, but I'm, I'm assuming that that's where the sport gets its name. Hopefully, you guys have a good team. Otherwise, that'd be a little awkward. Ah, I figured as much. It makes sense. All right, I want to reel this guy back in and then get the. Uh... Yep, there we go. Clear that weedage. All right, nope, wrong button. I need to alter the time because not only are you a fishing master in this game, but you are also a Time Lord. You can travel back and forth through time and relative space. Now, um, next morning, forward time, got this one. <clears throat> there we go, immediate dings. I like that. Dings are nice. And boom. Told you I'm getting good at that. Uh, this one's putting up a decent fight. That's good. Not unique good, though. Might be a trophy. Be a good start, I think. Trophy, trophy. So, how are y'all doing? I haven't asked the good questions yet. How are y'all doing? Any cool stories, fishing or fishing planet or just in life in general? Sorry about the creaky chair. Oh, yes. Friends request to Von Doom. Uh, yes, all lowercase. And uh, I'm going to have to wait till this reel is in. Or until this cast is in, rather. And then I will add you, and then you may join, yes. And of course, open invitation to anyone else who wants to join. That's good to hear, Krista. Alright, three, two, one, and... Boom! Gun Game Satan, sir. Whenever you want to do some... Some Gmod, let me know. I need some more content 
this upcoming week, even though I'm going to be busy filming. Like, actually filming. Uh, right, there is that. Let's get this going. Any... Nope, not yet. But yes, it is, as you can see, just Von Doom, no space, all lowers. And whenever you're ready to send that, I will check after every cast. And we'll get that going. Awesome. All right, after this cast, I'll go get it. So, hey, did anyone ever actually get the, uh, get the Frankenfish challenge finished? Because I did not. I was going to make videos on it and everything, but then I saw how much it was, or how much there was. I could have easily done it if I had the, co the bait coins. It's just another free-to-play faux pas. It's free to play, but we really want you to pay. I really wanted that thing too. Although the Halloween one from last year was super cool. I like that one way better. It was like a voodoo situation. Oop, got a ding. Come on back now. Don't get stuck, please. Please don't get stuck. You were really in there. That's weird. Just bite. Please bite? Okay, I've had enough of you. I'm recasting further. But first, let's get that invite out, or the invite received. Ah, I haven't, uh, I haven't, uh, I haven't gotten it yet. Out of curiosity, there, Mr. Law, are you, are you on PC? Are you on, on, uh, PlayStation? Because if you're on PlayStation, I don't think I'm going to be able to add you. I would not be surprised if there is a Von Doom. Here recently there seems to be a lot of Von Dooms cropping up and some of them use my content. Which I unfortunately have to, uh, have to take down. Oh, I'm sorry man. Yeah, I have PC here. I'd love to have you, though. Yeah. Honestly, I would still have my... Uh, I'd be doing this on PlayStation, but about a year and a half ago, I was sitting on my couch, as I usually do, and I looked down and... With my gaming habits and my eating style and my lack of wanting to do anything, I realized, realized that I was 316 pounds. So I decided to sell all of my consoles. And uh, step one to a diet that worked. Just something that had to be done, you know? You know, that really surprises me that they haven't made this cross-platform. I realize that they would have to make remake the entire game for a third time in order to do it. And, like, what I mean by that is the amount of coding to make that happen is literally the game itself in, in size. But, uh, it sure would be nice. I mean, it's not like 
PC players have a competitive advantage or anything. I know this chair is creaky. I've been using it for everything. This is actually my fishing chair. As well as my camping chair. And I was out at the Texas Renaissance Festival at the campgrounds. And yeah, there's a lot of action going on out, on out there. A lot of sitting action. Just take it already. This is why I hate float fishing. Uh. All right, casting it far. This is prime time to get a unique, though. Why I haven't caught, like, hardly anything is kind of a mystery to me. So I'm looking for some new content here. I do like Fishing Planet and all, but I mean, I've been doing it for over a year. And, uh, yeah. Um, so what are, what are the games you guys play? Like, the, what, the, what I'd like to do with this channel is take a free-to-play game, just like Fishing Planet, and show you guys the best way to play the game and win without having to actually spend money. Come here, you. Any ideas, anybody? Magic the Gathering Arena, I am actually a, a giant nerd, so I'm going to be doing a few tutorials on that for sure. Specifically how to spend in-game currency without spending out-of-game currency. And still ha still be able to, uh, to make your own. Come here, you. Oh yeah, for sure. Yeah, yeah. I'm not even paying attention to this fish. I've just been reading your message. Make sure I didn't miss anything. Uh, but it uh, looks like we got another trophy on the line here. Large trophy, I would assume. This putting up quite a fight. Oh, yeah. Oh, or a small unique. Sweet. All right. So that's one unique. And we still got plenty of time. We got two and a half in-game hours to catch uniques. So, that's one. This might be a new record for me. My record right now is, is uh, four uniques in one in-game day, so. Oh, yes. Yeah, the division is going to be pretty interesting. I liked I liked the original uh, division. I didn't play it much past the first expansion because I don't remember what came out. I'm assuming it was Battlefield because I am a Battlefield person. Not a Call of Duty person, but a Battlefield person. Not a first-person shooter person, but a Battlefield person. Um... And, uh, but yeah, I loved the gameplay. It was like an awesome FPS Diablo. Just go in somewhere, grab some gear, be better than your friends, and then kick their asses. Either in stats or in PvP. This one's got some fight too. And he's lining me out. I think I've got two uniques in a row. Alright. I'm going to have to switch to heavy fight mode here. Come on, you. Come 
While I'm doing this, what part of the of the upcoming expansion are you guys looking forward to the most? For me, it'll be the new lakes, new new content for me to make uh, videos on, and maybe some you know more views would be nice and subscribers. But um, yeah, yeah, it's another uni, 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 uni. Yeah. No, Jesus, I fought even heavier, harder than the uh, the twenty four pounder. Well, that's disappointing. But I mean, all the new gear too, like rod pods. Um, let's see, you're gonna be able to uh, do all kinds of stuff. It's gonna be pretty cool. Yeah. be interesting to see how they follow up the story because there is only enough written because this is a Tom Clancy game Tom Clancy is dead now unfortunately but uh it will definitely eh walleye alright sure I'll take it anyway uh definitely be interesting to see how they follow up the story without his direction from what I understand, it was just basically like a little idea plot that was written before he passed away. Like it hadn't quite come into full bloom, like Rainbow Six series or any of that. So I know I asked this before, but then you guys know where the blue catfish are here on this lake? I've got a subscriber that really wants to know, and so do I, because video content. Like, I've tried every deep spot I can find on the map, but I get nothing. There's no ripples, either. Uh, but Andrew, uh, one thing I do suggest if you are interested in doing uh, it's going to be uh, European Lakes and Netherland Lakes like specifically Netherland Lakes I think I'm not exactly sure I, eh, I'd have to reread the, the thing all I know is there's going to be a bunch of snoke Another trophy there. You know, I'm hitting it big with these trophies, that's for sure. It'd be nice to get some more unique, though. So. Yeah, but one thing I can say, Andrew, is uh, go ahead and stock up on that money. I know I said that before uh, when I first started this video, video, but if you're looking to uh, to get out and do some, some European fishing, then, uh, yeah, make sure you've got the money to do it. <laughs> All right, over on the dock by the canoe. Not sure if you run or buy lakes. Square dock, gotcha. I see. I see. Not sure if I've got setups. Or I'm not sure if I've got quite have a setup capable of catching a, a unique, but 
That would be interesting. I might do that here in a bit. Just head over there and see what's up. I think right now I'm using a 25 pound test line, which isn't bad. I mean, you can pretty much catch anything in here, but and then, you know, a 93 pound blue catfish might be a bit much. Yeah. Yeah, so my schedule's a little thrown off this week, um, because, uh, for those of you viewing not from America, um, we have this thing that, uh, some genius thought up a while back called Daylight Savings Time, which really applied more to rural America versus the urban population, and now that, you know, America's well over 75% urban it really doesn't apply anymore but it's stuck around anyway so uh this weekend we actually i think it was saturday night or sunday night around two o'clock in the morning we set our clocks back so everything feels wrong time wise so i almost didn't make it to the stream in time i'm reeling you in a little bit about Sunday night, yeah, 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 that's what it was. There we go. Oh. Really? I thought the U.S. was the only ones that did the, uh... The daylight savings time situation. That's weird. I know it was, uh... I believe it was... Oh gosh, what's his name? One of Benjamin Franklin's ideas. But much like things back in the day, a lot of people just took credit for other people's ideas. So, I mean, who knows? Unless y'all are trying to be like us, in which case, stop it. No one needs to be like us. It's a bad idea. We don't even like being us. Just kidding. That was not a political statement. Don't demonetize me, YouTube. Oh, God. Come here, you. Sure, man. We'll do. Well, now. Well, I... Eh. If you guys just wanted to, wouldn't attach to the T, we might still be English. You know, to this day, a little bit of, of, uh, of American history for you. To this day, there is no tax on pre-made sweet tea. Or pre-made tea at all. I thought that was, that was an interesting little thing. Or pre-made or otherwise. Which is nice, but they kind of missed the point.
Okay, got some fight from this one. Another trophy? Oh, no. Unique. Alright, that's two unis since 22. Once again, the unique put up a lot less of a fight than the trophies. Okay. Alright, so we're definitely keeping you. How are we doing? We've got an hour and a half until uni time is done. I do believe. Immediate. I'm about to run out of bag space, I just realized that. No, I don't have it. Uh, and the reason is, is because I've spent so much money doing these tutorial videos. Like, going out, doing science, making sure that I've got the best possible combination of gear. And, you know, spend all kinds of travel money and license money trying to figure it all out. That That's where all my money goes. And, uh, I think I actually got this one off of a pack. I was originally going to do a review on on the packs and see if they were worth it or not, but uh, I ended up not. So, here I am with my little free, all free, uh, real money, uh, 154 pounder. Might finish off with a uni here, might just be a large trophy. But ooh, it's going, okay. We're switching modes here. I'm here, you. Oh shit, <laughs> it's already been over a half hour. Okay, so since I haven't uh, talked about it in a half hour or so, um, let's see, Fishing Planet IRL. We're filming it next week. We're going out and having a fishing tournament. Two teams of two. And the uh, the winner will have the glory, but the loser will have a, uh, a punishment. And you guys get to decide what that punishment is. If you want to decide what that punishment is, then you can head down to... Uh, um, let's see here. Yes. Um... Anyway, you can just head down to uh, the uh, description, that's the one, and download, or uh, not download, sorry. Ah, uh, I've lost my track of thought here. Um, right, yeah, anyway, join the Discord and leave a suggestion. We have got some good suggestions going on right now, including uh, the loser will have to, to lick one entire fish, or the loser will have to eat a piece of stink bait, or something along those lines. So... The more options, the merrier. And of course, mad credit to the ones who actually get in. Now, let's see here. Was my bag actually full? No, not yet. Okay, one more. One more, then it's time to uh, 
switch. You're absolutely right though, getting a larger, that's actually something I've suggested multiple times on my channel, is if you're ever going to spend money, it should be on a, uh, a larger keep bag. And that's because, well, for that very reason, it saves you money. No other bike, 152, 154, yeah, let's go ahead and cycle so I don't do too much damage to my bag. And what does tomorrow hold for us? It is going to be, ew, gross. It's going to be gross. Okay, well, uh, let's see here. But it's going to give me the perfect opportunity to do a little science. Let me, uh, I got my text screen. Oh. Sorry, guys. It seems that my, uh, my YouTube Live dashboard has been disabled. Give me just a moment while I try and get my text messages back up here. Test. Excellent. All right, it's back up and running. Sorry about that. Anyway, um, yeah, so tomorrow's going to be gross, it looks like, but we are going to... Oh, wait, no, I didn't need to actually move you over. There we are. Head to about, ooh, 9, 10, 10 o'clock. And then we're gonna do a little, little, little bit of science. A little bit of science. Oh, let's see here. All right, so we go back. There we go. Fast forward time, and yes, we are going to go to 10 a.m., was it? No, 10 a.m. tomorrow. Or I guess 9 a.m. All right, forward time. Extend. Now, let's take a look at our map. So if I'm not mistaken, the kayak rentals are out here. So I'm assuming this would be about the area where we would find catfish. And there's the floating pier and all that, and that will be nice. And let's see if there's any action going on midday, which there actually should be. The water's warm, and that's one of the things that catfish do. This is war Ooh, excuse me, warm water. Like the extremes of the water, the warmest and the coldest, specifically for the blue catfish. Now, let's go take a look and see if I can't wreck my line on a, uh, a uni. Uh, let's see here. I need to go to... Oh, wait, yes, that and then that, and then that. And is it that? Do I have to go out to that? I don't wanna. Do I have any cut bait? I'm sure I have cut bait. Let's see here. I do not have cut bait. Okay, I do, I do. I've got a little bit of cut bait. Enough for science, for sure. And I got some frogs, too. All right. Okay, all right, so go fishing. I don't want to run, how much is it? It can't be that much, is it? It's only four grand. But first, before we do that, let's take a look and see if there is a, oh, okay. I uh, gotcha. Can't, uh, can't do that, okay. Or is it that square one? Stop that. See any ripples out there? Might just be at night, guys. But good to know. Oh, squeaky chair. Sorry. Foot's falling asleep. Ah! 
Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, what's this one looking like? Oh no, that's the boat. Gotcha. Is there any ripplage over here? No. Alright, let's map. See what we can see from over here. Go fishing. Alright, where's that platform dock? You know, as cool as this game is, one thing they could really work on is a shadow. I'm just saying. Like, where is it? Should be around here somewhere, yeah? Oh, but I do see... Was that some ripplage I just saw right there? Or was that just the roof coming into focus? Or the reflection thereof? It must have been. Am I blind? I just not see it? it? Should be like around here somewhere. Oh well. Alright, well, back to making money. We're gonna continue to do a little science, though. We're gonna catch some, uh, some muskies, which I haven't really done a lot of research on. They are less per pound, less money per pound, that is, possibly more experience per pound. But in order to do this, we are going to change our setup just a wee bit. We're gonna be switching to large minnows for one. Recasting out towards that green marker, which you may or may not be able to see. It's off in that direction. And we're going to do a do or two. Let's see here. So I know for muskies, although they do go after shiners, they prefer large minnows. And, uh, let's see here. Um, wait, yeah, that was the other thing. We're going to need to switch to about 40 inches. Let's do 42. I like that better. It is the answer, after all. So about right there, which I can barely see. Nowhere near far enough, but hey, who knows? This is for science after all. We're going to give this a few minutes, and then if I don't get anything, then we're going to switch back to catching other things. Well, okay. I give up. Musab, do I have some news for you, sir? I've been asking around on your question, and as it turns out, I found out where they are. That's the blue catfish, to be exact. 
Um, it's something, apparently, that's best done at night. If you're going to be going for uniques, you're going to be going at night. And you will be starting here at the kayak rental. Now, here's the thing. They say that it's going to be around this square place right here, which you can get to via kayak. So, if you happen to have a kayak, that's one thing. However, renting one's going to cost you around, I think it's four grand? Four grand for one day. If you've got a good enough gear set up, you can cast out there. The way to get the longest cast, if you're interested, though, is to match up, let's see here, your line weight with the uh, the line, obviously. So I've got 30 pound test, or 30 pounds, so a 30 pound test line would be perfect. Also match it up with the max drag here. So if I get a max drag on my reel of 30, um, and then 30 pound rod, and then 30 pound test line, I'll get the maximum, uh, the maximum cast. However, 30 pounds is not going to be enough to catch a unique. In fact, you'll probably wreck your line doing it. Because they can go get up to uh, 100 pounds. Hello, you know who it is. It's good to see you. Also, good suggestion on Discord, by the way. That's probably my favorite. So far. Uh, but that's going to be your, your go-to spot. And you know what? Since this day is a bad weather day for the fish that I was supposed to be going after, then I am going to go ahead and switch tonight and see what I can do there. I don't have the right kind of setup for it, but I do have the right kind of bait, which is going to be large cut bait. And we're obviously going to need a rather large hook, as they are rather large fish with rather, rather large faces. Let's go with the number six aught there. And maximum depth. And we're going to see just how good this intel that I've gathered is. I'm going to go catch a few catfish here. Uh, let's see. Skip. Yes. And they said night time, so we're going to start at 9 p.m. I'm going to use a little bit of my money here and rent a kayak since I don't actually have one of my own. There we are. Said you should be able to see the ripples. Is there a way to sprint? You know, like, power kayak? Ooh. I guess so. <laughs> nice. Do I know when the Europe... I, I, I should. I, if anyone's going to know it, it's going to be me or a developer. Uh, but unfortunately, I don't. Uh, but then I haven't really looked. The information might be public. Oh yeah, there's the ripples I'm looking for. They are here, Masab. They are here for sure. Is there any way to actually get out? There is. Nice. That's what you're going to be looking for, is those big, wide ripples. There's another big one right there. So we, we're just going just gonna to cast right here and see what happens. I've already got a ding. Not a problem, sir. Anything I can do to help. I mean, Fishing Planet is a community, and helping each other out is really the oh oh really the best way for us to succeed in a free-to-play game. Oh yeah, <laughs> already maxed out my drag. Let's see what we get here. Come on, you. Ooh, monster. Beans, baby, there it is, 27 pounds. This a little baby. Since I'm here and since it's nighttime, I might as well just catch a few more of these guys for a while. I 
All right, since it's just about been 30 minutes, um, I'm going to go ahead and touch on Fishing Planet IRL again. Uh, we are going to be facing off two teams, one armed with knowledge of the lake and one armed with knowledge of Fishing Planet only, and see how accurate Fishing Planet really is in a contest of fish. Um, the losing team will be... Uh, will be punished in some way. And if you'd like to ha have some some input on how the losing team will be punished, whether it be me or the other team, me and my friend or the other team, that is, there we are, then uh, go ahead and join the, discar the Discord, which is uh, down in the... D the link is down in the description below. No, yeah, it, it's really boring. As it turns out, Andrew, it did. And, um, in fact, the guy who asked me, Mr. Musab Bilkay, um, has, uh, has joined, and I've been able to give him your message as well. And yes, uh, one blue so far. I just got out here. And I've got one on the line, I'm pretty sure. I do not have a powerful setup here. It's just a 30-pound setup. So I suppose this guy's probably around 50, 40, somewhere in there. 30. Ouch. Not the best for money, but good chunk of experience. Yeah. That's one thing I did as soon as I could, is I got the, uh, I got the unlimited license so I could save money. That's another good expenditure for this game. Alright, come on, you. Get a big bag, get uh, a uh, unlimited license at New York and Michigan if you can. Oh, trophy, 50 pounder. Also, new personal record. Go me. Yeah, man, this is a easy way to fill up your your keep net, and in fact, I'm almost at max capacity. However, my keep net's not quite big enough to keep a unique if I catch it. I think I've got a yeah max of 66.1 pounds. Yeah, but if you're excited about that European uh, expansion, uh, one thing I can suggest is... Oh, let's see here. Also find fish. A lot of XP for money. Yes. I do suggest, if you're going for money, um, that pike is what you're going to need to go for. I've got a couple videos on how to best get pike, and if you watch this stream once it's become a video watch the recording of the stream, you'll see in another way. After I catch these blues, though, I'm going to go back to getting pike, because although this is fun, and they're they're hitting really quick, I'm going to be doing, uh, be going on back to, uh, to catch pike, and in fact, I'm going to go ahead and do that now, because my keep net is, uh, is pretty much full. And the next day, oops, extend stay. Yes, I would like to. Uh, nope, I would not like to. Close. Oh, awesome. So you're already ahead of the game. Now, let's see here. Yeah, anyway, like I was saying, one thing I would suggest is stock up that money. Like, go ahead, if you're interested in the expansion, go ahead, grind out those uh, the spotted bass. And head on up, catch those walleye. Head on up, catch those pikes. And uh, let's just get to... Yeah. Yeah, same here. I did not finish the uh, the Halloween challenge. I didn't even start it. I saw how much it was going to cost in gold, and I was like, nope. 
Now, let's see here. Inventory. Let's see, we're gonna switch to 40 inches. And for the first couple hours, I'm gonna be going after musky because why not? It sounds fun. Go fishing. Nope, okay, I need a location, which is gonna be here. I'm gonna go fishing. The best time to go after the large musky and unique musky are gonna be in the morning, before, uh, like early morning. So before it becomes high time for pike, it's high time for musky. It's not as much money, but it's close. And uh, it's, they're interesting fights. Um, I think unique is around 50 pounds, 40 pounds, somewhere around there. Oh. All right, so I, oh, yeah, let's see. I do have a spot for musky and it requires a kayak. However, I can reach it from here and if you can see through the, the reeds there, it's right there as far as I can. So I'm just gonna go ahead and do one of these and hope for the best. Oh, and it's immediately stuck, okay. isn't working out well. I'm gonna go ahead and try one more time here and then it's back to Pike. Oh, well, maybe that's why. <laughs> Sweet, I got loot. Um, discard. Nice. That's a good question. I don't know what my, my, what is my, huh. Let's see, inventory. Uh, how do I check that? Probably here. Fish records. I have zero. There we are. Uh, 50 pound blue, 40 pound historic musky. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. I haven't gone after, I have actually gone after Gar yet, but uh. 40 pound for the gar. Northern Pike's at 39. Yeah. Not too bad. There we go. That should be perfect. And yes, it is. Awesome. Right there in the hole. And I think they release around the, uh, uh, the 4th of July, if I'm not mistaken. They are amazing XP. In fact, I got my 40th level and my 41st level off of that, off of those two fish. Let's give it a few more minutes here, a few more moments rather.
If I'm being completely honest with you guys, the only reason I've played this game for so long is YouTube. <laughs> Ooh, got a ding. Um, and it's not that I don't like the game. It's a really good game. It's really well made. And anyone that puts an effort into something they produce, I think it's, it's worth, you know, quite a bit. And there's the bite. And, yep, he's lining me out. We got a good one here. Oh, for sure. And yes, <laughs> Fishing Planet does get does get the views. Although it's getting, it's gotten, uh, it's below half of what it used to be at this moment. I've got to find a new game. It's a tiger musky. It's just a little one. Alright. In fact, the uh, fishing planet has been not nearly time. Okay, never mind. Not going to be talking about fishing planet IRL at the moment. Okay, so let's switch us back to that thing that gets us the money, which is shiners. And 17 inches. Yep. yep. There we are. Oh, I feel ya. Obviously, I'm not the biggest YouTuber, so I have a real job. Um, and at the same time, also learning Japanese, which I'm doing pretty good at, because, yeah, it's fun. Languages are, are really my thing. I can speak three and a half? Not doing too horrible. Um, I just learned the most important sentence in Japanese, which is, um, uh, Jonathan, wait, Jonathan Hoshi Osaki, which is Jonathan wants alcohol. So, um, yeah, I've got that covered. I can able do. I can able français. I can uh, spreche Deutsch and uh, working on Japanese and uh, let's see, a little bit of Spanish. That's my half. Which, since I live in Texas, you'd think Spanish would be probably the best one to learn. I just. I just don't like it. It's not that it's a bad language, I just you know, don't like it. Oh no, yeah, that's perfect. perfect. That's about where I started. The only reason I got lucky with Fishing Planet is because when I started releasing videos on it, it hit uh, PlayStation. And then the PlayStation audience is really what drove up the uh, the views. Oh, and I know some words in Arabic. Not very many, I just dated an Arabic a lady from Morocco for a while. She was a cool person. I liked her. Really? I thought your name was Masab, but I mean... Or you are Turkish. I'm sorry, I'm not 100% on, on French. <laughs> I've, I have what's called a, a B2 understanding of the language. Oh, okay. I know how to welcome a, a, a welcome a lady to a house, which is marhaba uh, bikom e la manzili a nazati, which is welcome to my house. Ma'am or madam. Um, 
And, uh, I know the butterfly is Faraja. That's about it for Arabic for me. Uh, so far in Japanese, I know, uh, let's see here. Uh, watashi wa. Um, mine's the same way. Uh, watashi wa, um, no, sorry, hold on. Watashi wa Jonathan des. I am Jonathan. Um, watashi wa Amerikajin, which is, I am an American. And, um, hold on. Give me a sec. Anatawa oh, not. Aisha Deska which I believe is is that man a doctor which I, I, th I feel is actually a fairly important question or is that, is that person a doctor? Yep, yep, yep. Yeah, I'm the same way, though. Um, I am mostly Polish, I believe. It has been confirmed that my entire family is Polish, but my last name is German. Um, <laughs> yes. Um, there's apparently some French in there, too, from what I understand. I have nobody here, though, so I'm assuming I'm mostly Polish. And I got a fucked up nose, so I'm mostly Polish. But anyway. Um, let's see. Yes, it is an Arabic name. From what I understand about, well, from the one person I've dated from Morocco, the Morocco, the Morocco isn't necessarily Arabic either. Although I'm sure, I feel it's more Arabic than Turkey is. As Turkey has a long and important history away from the Arab nation. Whereas Morocco is just kind of, okay, we're here now. Gotcha. Oh, 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 okay, okay, hold on. Oh yeah, you've... You're a, a decent mix. I'm the white mix, you're the brown mix. <laughs> Could be looking at another unique here. Come on now. Seriously, come on. I, just, I mean, the fight's nice and all, but I'm streaming here. You know, don't don't give me this crap. This way.
Nope. Okay, 21 pounds though. Real close. Real close. I think uh, Unique starts at 22 or 22 and a half or 23. Okay, catching trophies like nobody's business, that's nice. I do think I've, I've officially zeroed in on exactly what it takes. Oh, yeah, yeah. Some of them are, are, uh, are options. Um, but, uh, like, I, I think the, uh, the separate reels the real rod and uh, and line thing is an option, but uh, a lot of the like the depth meter, which isn't shown here, is is a newer situation. That and the uh, the bobber thing is a lot more smooth. indicator 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 Jesus living in Texas too long I'm now there indicator man dang old thing man tell you what Yeah, I hear you dinging. Just bite it already. There it is. Ah, there's a little bit of lag there. Uh, my bad. Oh, um, 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 no, he's not here. Dang it. Out of curiosity, uh, you know who it is if you're still here. Um, what, uh... When you do captures for videos, what, uh... What system do you use? Is it a XSplit, like Bonsai Cam, or anything like that? He's probably gone.
Hold on. Alright, I think this is going to be my last cast. I wanted to let you guys know um, that because Fishing Planet IRL is coming out soon, and it's going to take up a good five days of my editing time, because we've got three cameras, we have a drone getting B-roll footage, we have production value out the butt. Uh, it's going to be a lot of work for me, and besi besides doing that, I also have to do work. I've got to learn Japanese, I've got all kinds of stuff to do. I mean, it's not like I've got a girlfriend or anything, but I mean, you know, it's just uh, I've got a lot on my plate at the moment. But, um, let's see. Basically, what I am going... Oh, yeah, sure, what's up, my dude? best way to get bait coins um well i hate to say it but uh the best way to get bait coins is just to uh constantly log in and catch a fish every day well i mean you don't even have to catch a fish anymore um it's just logging in will get you the login bonus and then after a while um you'll uh start getting i think it's after seven days everything after seven days will get you a bait coin however whenever the uh the the Fishing Planet anniversary goes on. They give over a hundred bait coins every... Oh, really? Jerks. Anyway, over a hundred bait coins every... Um, oh, how nice. Every time you log in. That's like for two weeks. So that is going to be where you get it. However, if you want to wager at all on, on uh, maybe getting 10 or 20... Um, back or more then competitions are where you need to get, be going for bait coins uh if you're good and confident in your method of fishing then i do suggest it and if you're a low level you remember you can do the novice ones which are uh less uh less costly and uh you've got a better chance of winning if you know what you're doing because you the level 40 pros are now out there doing it so that's really the two good ways to get bait coins. And don't know too much beyond that. But anyway, I just wanted to tell you guys that unfortunately, when it comes to videos, I'm going to be, a, be on a bit of a hiatus until this, uh, until the editing is done for the Fishing Planet IRL. Uh, so there will be some videos. I'm still going to be doing my streams. Oh, yeah. But... Uh, yeah. I mean, I might come out with an SCP episode once or twice. Because I mean, SCP Containment Breach is hilariously scary. And, yeah. Anyway, that's going to be about it. But I guess questions still remain. For example, what is the next fish? What is the fish that we're going after uh, for Fishing Planet IRL? I'll give you a hint. It's a fish that I've never done a video on. Um, absolutely, sir. Um... The, uh, uh, yeah, what other questions? What is going to be the punishment for, um, Fishing Planet IRL? The losing, losing team will have to endure. Uh, you can influence that by joining the Discord, link down in the description, and, yeah, you can find out the answers to those and more on the next episode of Von Doom Gaming!